Maybe I just found the answers Maybe I just found the answers in you Come give me all your love I want you to know We can make it together
stuff from it for it off of Amazon yesterday and I was like, I'm gonna go ahead and order it so I'll have it on hand, but I'm not gonna need it for a couple months. I did not think I was gonna get pregnant that easy. I honestly kind of thought that I had become infertile since having Ashlyn for some reason. I don't know what's stuck in my head. And now he's home all the time. I might 
to you like with that tiniest vein. He's like, no, there's absolutely nothing. Mama. This and say, yeah, there's a second line. Mama. The color is not showing up on camera, but it is colored. It's very, Mama. it's very pink, but the camera's not picking up on it. I don't know what to do with these tests now. And the trash, I gotta get rid of the trash. Mama. What action? Oh. I'm supposed to be deep cleaning the house today. Oh. 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 oh my god. Mama. I bought these before we left. Just <laughs> escaping to go to the store um so yeah Christopher woke up and he's gonna stay here and watch the kids so I can go get groceries which I mean I am getting groceries but I also need to get um pregnancy tests Embarrassing, but I totally just rinsed my Starbucks cup out with water, a water bottle from the pack of water I just bought, um, so that I could pee in it in the Walmart parking lot because I had to be really freaking mad, and I couldn't go in the store because I had a cart full of groceries. Like, is this pregnancy bladder already coming on? Because. Mm. But yeah, I'm also going to take one of the tests just while I can when I'm away. I'm only going to take, I got the two pack where one is the regular test and one is the digital. I don't want to take the digital quite yet because I don't want the screen to go away um, before I can use it, you know? Because don't they, doesn't the digital thing go away? But, yeah, the digital thing, I don't want to risk it not staying pregnant anymore. Because that's the main thing I want to show Christopher is the digital one. Dip into the container for 20 seconds. Oh, wait, that's for the digital. Where's the other one? It's a different language. Where's the directions for the regular one? Alright, dip for five seconds. And read in three. It says one to three minutes. Okay. I'm not gonna show you my pee because that's gross and I'm definitely a little dehydrated. Um, I've not been doing a good job of drinking water. Well, I mean, I actually was in South Carolina because everyone had, um, what you want to call it? How do I know which one's digital? Everyone had like water filters or whatever. Okay, this is the digital. So it was really easy for me to keep my water full. So I actually did pretty good drinking water there. But now that I'm back in Ohio and we've been traveling, yeah, I haven't been doing too good. Alright. Once again, I gotta hide all my good stuff. turns pink I don't I never really use clear blue because I don't like I don't like blue dye because I've had a lot of false positives with blue dye but I think it, I'm like okay to trust it because I wanted a like a line test and a digital test so there was the clear blue two-pack where there was the first response two-pack um, 
some, which the clear blue is cheaper and also, are you gonna go? Also, the first response one says yes or no instead of pregnant or not pregnant. And for some reason, I just prefer it to say pregnant instead of yes. I don't know. So yeah, that's why I went clear blue, which it's not going across. Should I dip it again? Or should I just give it a little bit longer? <laughs> I see it popping up. I know my jank nails, I really need to get them done. Like, my thumb, all the paint came off because of me opening, like, getting the kids in and out of the car seat or getting them out. Their little bottom buckle, it, like, just kept tipping away at the top and then all eventually just peeled off. So, yeah. My nails really need to be redone. But we've had a lot going on. Let's see, third positive test, and I'm still like, I'm still kind of in disbelief, honestly. But like, they're obviously positive. I don't know why my phone does not really want to focus on things. But it's very clearly positive. Still not super dark, but it'll get there. And this is only at like a minute, almost a minute and a half in, so. I seriously just like can't stop staring at it. I feel like this one's going to take a while to sink in. I don't know. But the thing is, it's like, I don't think I even had any symptoms that like made me think, oh, pregnancy, really? Like... I mean, I know I'm still early, so like symptoms don't always show super early. Oh shit, don't tell me that. Never mind, I can't go that way because it's all blocked off. How the fuck am I supposed to get home? Well, that person went. I don't know how to get home from here. Am I turn down this road? I'm gonna try it. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, like, I don't think. I've had any symptoms. Maybe some cramping, which has always been like my telltale sign that I was pregnant with both kids. I just got really super duper intense um, cramps, but they also felt more like, it sounds gross, but they feel like a combination of cramps and like diarrhea pain, you know? <laughs> but I got it both times with the kids right before I found out I was pregnant with them. Um, that was one of my, or like my first symptom with both of them. But it's not like a constant symptom for me. It kind of would just happen like a couple times randomly. It wasn't like, oh yeah, I feel like crampy almost every day or for a long period of time or something like that. Like it would happen like a couple times and that was it, like maybe three times. It's really weird. Um, and it's almost like, I want to call it like a placebo effect. I'm saying I felt no symptoms, but then as soon as I saw the positive test, it's like, wait, I kind of feel a little bit nauseous now. And so I felt like the tiny, I'm, I haven't cried this whole time. Why is this going to be what makes me cry? <sighs> like, what? I mean, like, seriously, um... It's like I felt the tiniest bit nauseous ever since I found out earlier today. So it's like I felt fine this whole time and then it's like, oh, you're pregnant, so you're nauseous. Like, I don't know if it's just like some weird like mind game or if it's like nerves making me um, nauseous or like anxiety or what. I'm not sure. but. Yeah, I feel the tiniest bit nauseous today just since I found out, but besides that, I don't think I've had any symptoms that made me think, oh, maybe I'm pregnant. Like, at all. <laughs> and I did such a good job of not testing, like I told myself not to test the whole time I was in South Carolina. I had tests, I could have tested, but I didn't that whole time, 
and I'm proud of myself for not stressing over it like that. And then I get here and I take a nap and I wake up and I take a test and it's like, bam, positive. And I was like, holy shit, I did not expect that. Because I literally have been joking to Christopher for weeks now, like, oh yeah, I think I might be infertile now. Like, I don't know that we can have another or like, it's probably going to take a while to get pregnant. Like, I definitely thought it was going to take months and months of trying. Which technically it did take um, close to a year to get pregnant with Ashlyn, but I was breastfeeding like 95% of the time that we were trying and that's why I couldn't get pregnant. But yeah, apparently I do still get pregnant easily. Because I got pregnant with London first month trying. Ashlyn first month, well not first month, but like right after I finally got my period back is whenever I got pregnant with Ashlyn. And now first month with this, I end up pregnant. So yeah, I'm gonna hide this test too. Christopher's about to come out here to help me get the groceries in. Give a little bit of your heart, give a little bit of your heart to me. 